fish undergo various life stages throughout their lifetime, similar to humans who have six life stages altogether from fetus, baby, child, adolescent, adult and old person, fish too experience six stages in their life cycle. The origin of fish life begin from a simple small egg. Eggs that have been fertilized from a male and female fish will develop into embryo. The hardened eggs will hatch once the conditions are appropriate, which means temperature plays an important role in determining the egg hatching time. The embryo refers to the stage where fish is still unable to feed itself. The food for the embryo comes from the mother either directly through the egg yolk or indirectly through the blood. Embryonic stage could be divided into two, inside and outside of egg. In both stages, the general characteristic is where the embryo still nourish itself through the nutrients from the mother. Once hatched, the head will come out first followed by the tails as the embryo need to push itself to come out easily. Now, once the egg hatch, larva will emerge. Larva stage also defined by two stages, pre-larva and post-larva. Pre-larva is when the yolk is still intact on the body and fish will rely on the yolk until it is fully absorbed. So, the period for post-larva is in between the hatching until the end of yolk absorption. Some organ begin to develop during this stage and it will start searching for food from outside. Zooplankton are among the usual dietary requirement for post-larva stage. Then, the juvenile will take place once the fish looks like miniature adult. Nearly all internal organs and fin have fully developed although coloration may look different from the adult stage. During this phase, the young fish will require a high percentage of protein content in their diet as they will literally live to eat and grow. Once the functional gonad already fully developed, it will be the end of their juvenile life stage. Adulthood begins when the reproduction capability is fully functional. It will begin with the first maturing of gonad and end when it no longer could reproduce. Changes of color pattern, spawning behavior, and secondary character in certain species will clearly observed during this period. The adulthood could be the longest phase in many fish life as it can last for many years. The final stage is the senescence, in which fish will stop reproduce. By this time, due to the old age, the growth rate is slowing down and it may last for only few hours just like salmon or might be several years such as in sturgeon. So that's how a fish undergo a full cycle of life. Isn't it amazing? If you think it is, why not thumbs up this video and subscribe to our YouTube channel so we could share much more amazing stories of our fishes. Until then, thank you for watching and see you next time.